In this era of instant non-stop news, stories are immediately published across multiple platforms 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. But in this competitive rush, Croatia Soldat's newspaper, Večerni List, still believes accuracy is more important than speed. Znači, mi nekad radije namjerno ne izađemo odmah prvi, makar imali prvu informaciju u redakciji, baš iz razloga jer uvijek nastavimo imati provjerenu informaciju i sa više izvora. At Croatia's most watched television news, Nova TV, steps are taken to make sure all sources are reliable. Dakle, ako je jedan izvor dao informaciju, to ne znači da je ta informacija od tog izvora točna. Morate još zvati hrpu drugih izvora, 3, 4, 5, dok vam isti ti izvori ne potvrde tu informaciju. Nova TV news executive producer Branimir Felger believes serious news organizations need journalists who are experts in the topics they cover. Novinari moraju znati procese u svijetu, novinari moraju znati o čemu razgovaraju, s kim razgovaraju i tko im to priča. Ja želim vjerovati da su novinari ozbiljni ljudi koji znaju procijeniti težinu svojih riječi izgovorene riječi i pisane riječi da take loše stvari ne rade. Fake news or disinformation is spread intentionally with the goal to mislead others. Fake news isn't new. It has happened before in history, but social media has turned it into a dangerous weapon. Audiences often spread words and images in the form of misinformation, innocently believing the information they are sharing is true. Pročitati će nešto neće provjeriti, zato što će vjerovati izvoru koji možda nije vjerodostojan, podijeliti će to na društvenoj mreži. To će vidjeti krug njihovih istomišljenika, podijeliti će dalje. Oni će opet vidjeti tu informaciju koja će im se vratiti, jer svi znamo da Facebook zapravo stvara informacijske petlje. American President Donald Trump has popularized the term fake news on a global scene. It is his mantra as he frequently attacks the news media. But in reality, research shows fake news is produced and spread by politicians, political activists and propaganda experts, all hoping to bypass the traditional news media and set their own agenda. To curb the spread of fake news, especially around elections, the European Union created an action plan against disinformation. That plan shows the audience how to spot fake news and report it before it spreads. The conference in Zagreb featured talks on Russia's disinformation campaign by two investigative journalists from Hungary and Estonia. Very important to note that uh, fake news is uh, effective when it's not planting something new into people's head, but when it plays to already existing fears or concepts or, as you said, stereotypes about uh, certain groups of people. I think that now, at least in theory, people know that disinformation and fake news exist, but if they are reading content uh, on Facebook, uh, whatever social media uh, sites or whatever, I don't think that they are consciously thinking still too much or paying attention. Crowded into lecture at Zagreb's political science faculty, students are eager to understand more about fake news and how it gets confused with satire. Well-known Croatian political satire comedians said how their own story was shared by some media as real news. <laughs> Svaki mjesec novi portal u Srbiji prenosi tu mjesecu. I Srbi, to je to, dokazali, evo i Hrvati su priznali, nauka ne laže. The news bar team is aware of the possibility of confusion, but they told the audience political satire is not fake news. On their website they clearly declared what kind of media content they produce. Dakle, nigdje na fake news, nigdje fake news ne kaže, e, slušajte, mi se bavimo laganjem. A satira to jasno kaže. Newsbar was recently sued for the defamation and has to pay a fine. Nama je prvenstveno reč 
mi se borimo protiv moći. Mi ne sprdamo ljudi koji nisu poznati. Mi ne sprdamo ljudi koji nemaju moći, koji nisu ništa u društvu. Mi napadamo samo one koji već o nečemu odlučuju. I to je to. To avoid the spread of fake news takes education both of the audience and the journalists. It takes both of them developing critical reading and thinking skills according to newspaper journalist Milena Zajović. Ne propitujemo. Prestali smo propitivati. Pogotovo na društvenim mrežama gdje se strahovito brzo izmijenju informacije gdje ćemo često pročitati samo naslove podijeliti. Znači nećemo čak ići toliko daleko da pročitamo tekst, a kamo li da provjerimo informacije. Now the audience needs skills to question stories before they share them. The real question remains. Who will teach the audience the media literacy and critical thinking skills they 